Pets like dogs are really an integral part of our daily lives. They're really more like family, but with shorter lifespans. Absolutely. We're now learning, though, more about their aging process. News 8's Monique Griego explains why even cat lovers like me should care. Well, that myth is that one human year is equivalent to seven years in dog years, but actually researchers say that definitely isn't true. And now they're looking into how they can evaluate how dogs age because we're with them so closely like these guys right here and see how that can affect our aging or improve our aging process. <coughs> They've long been considered man's and women's best friends. People do love their dogs, don't they? Dr. Trey Eideker is a professor of genetics in the Department of Medicine at the University of California, San Diego. The myth that I think everyone is familiar with is that one year in a dog's life is approximately equal to seven years in a human's life. But a new study conducted by UCSD shows that's not the case. They're aging very nonlinear. But in general, the smaller the dog, the longer it lives. That means a dog at one years old is really like a 30-year-old human and a four-year-old dog around 52. Take a look at this comparison to Tom Hanks in a Labrador. Genome technology, molecular technology and biology has really revolutionized the way we can make measurements of things like age. So what we have developed is a molecular measurement of how fast aging occurs. So let's say you're not a dog lover, not judging you. Maybe you're a cat person. So you may be thinking, why does this matter to me? Why dogs are interesting to study. Uh, one of the reasons is they are lifetime companions of, of people. They are in, and they live much shorter lifespans. Which means learning more about a dog's aging process can give us more insight into our own. They get the same medical care really, I think, has potential to, to learn how to increase human life as well. We are going to get a handle on longevity and how to promote healthy aging in people. Dogs are a great place to start. And obviously, because Rocco, again, is going to be 13 right now, almost in December. And we think she's around six or seven. She's a Humane Society dog, so we're not really sure. Um, I'm definitely hoping I can find better ways to help myself age and help them age. If you would like to have more information on this study, just go to CBSA.com and click on this story. Monique Griego, News 8.